book called It's Friday, but Sunday's coming. <clears throat> it's a series of essays by Dr. Anthony Campolo, and the title piece tells of a church service in which Campolo participated. A Good Friday service that remembered those horrific events that led up to Jesus' death. It's a line from a sermon preached by one of the speakers that day, an African-American pastor. Dr. Campolo writes, for an hour and a half, he preached one line over and over again. It's Friday, but Sunday's coming. He started his sermon real softly by saying, it was Friday. It was Friday and my Jesus was dead on the tree. But that was Friday and Sunday's coming. One of the deacons yelled, preach, brother, preach. It was all the encouragement he needed. He came on louder as he said, it was Friday, and Mary was crying her eyes out. The disciples were running in every direction like sheep without a shepherd. But that was Friday, and Sunday's coming. The preacher kept going. He picked up the volume still more, and he shouted, it was Friday. The cynics were looking at the world and saying, as things have been, so shall they be. You can't change anything in this world. You can't change anything. But those cynics didn't know that it was only Friday. Sunday's coming. It was Friday, and on Friday those forces that oppress the poor and make the poor to suffer were in control. But that was Friday, and Sunday's coming. It was Friday, and on Friday Pilate thought he had washed his hands of a lot of trouble. The Pharisees were strutting around, laughing and poking each other in the ribs. They thought they were back in charge of things, but they didn't know it was Friday and Sunday's coming. The polo continues. He kept on working that phrase for half an hour, then an hour, then an hour and a quarter, and then an hour and a half. Over and over he came at us. It's Friday, but Sunday's coming. By the time he had come to the end of the message, he had me and everybody else so worked up that I don't think any of us could have stood it much longer. At the end of this message, he just yelled at the top of his lungs, It's Friday! And all 500 of us in that church stood up and yelled with one accord, But Sunday's coming! People of heritage, this is the good news this morning. This is our message of hope. When life gets us down, our word is Sunday's coming. When the love we've counted on is gone and you feel that you may never know love again, the word is that Sunday's coming. When you see what's happening on the streets of the city and you're angry, and frustrated and afraid, you think, but it's Friday and Sunday's coming. When you've lost your belief in the miraculous and no longer expect great things from God, you can look at your calendar and say, Sunday's coming. When you're so far down that you don't remember well, the word is that Sunday's coming. This is a crazy, cruel world. But the hope that sustains us is that Sunday's coming. 